Hi, I'm Lee Teschler from Design World Magazine. I'm here with Saeed Azimi from uh, DinoSense. DinoSense. And um, DinoSense has done is used advanced electronics to make some measurements of human systems, including blood pressure, without using a blood pressure cuff. Saeed, how exactly do you do that? Yes, so that's a very good question. What we are able to do is by integrating 12 different sensors into a single device uh, that able to capture both the electrical characteristics, which we call EKG, as well as doing photoplasmography, which is optical uh, measurements of how the blood flows through your system. Uh, by having information at our disposal from those two, uh, we can deduce uh, what the blood pressure in the system is and able to track the, uh, the blood pressure at much better accuracy than a mechanical cuffway. Can you tell us what those sensors are that you use? Okay, so uh, one of them is electrical sensors, uh, the other one is an optical sensors, and then we have a number of uh, uh, respiratory, uh, for example, a pressure sensor, uh, as well as gas sensors. Uh, we also have motion sensors to be able to detect uh, um, artifacts in the measurements that we have. We also have temperature sensors, uh, humidity sensors. Uh, so those are the examples of all the different sensors we've integrated into that single unit. And the uh, device that you've come up with, for example, for uh, checking your breath, it's tiny. Yes. Uh, talk to us a little bit about the electronics in that thing. Okay. So, uh, as I say, it's a very complex device. It has a variety of electronics integrated. Uh, for the gas sensor itself, it's two different types of uh, sensors. It's a optochemoresistive sensors that we've included in, the, in our unit that is able to chemically uh, detect the makeup component of the gas that, uh, that is being exposed to. Interesting. Um, you've got a demonstration set up for us over here. Why don't you uh, take us through that? Sure, absolutely. So our unit is very simple to use. It takes less than 60 seconds. Uh, it's as simple as uh, uh, basically a digital thermometer. Uh, and we like to say it's a digital thermometer on steroids. <laughs> um, and uh, as we will show you through the demo, uh, the person just takes the unit in his left hand and places it in the, uh, in the mouth and then you breathe naturally. Uh, and then the device, just like a digital thermometer, will beep at you. And then once that beeping is completed, uh, you know the process is done and uh, all the data is now available for analysis in our cloud. In fact, what our, one of the innovations that we brought in, most sensors out there, they try to do all the computation inside the sensor. But what we do is we actually gather and ship that information into the cloud and take advantage of the power of the cloud to do more sophisticated analysis of the information. Okay, and the uh, subject also stands on a scale while he's Okay, doing yes, that's a very good point. And we also have an, an addition to our unit, which is a body composition scale. And so the person can also stand on the scale at the same time that's using our sensor. And what that does also measures the weight and that is makeup of your body composition. Interesting, how accurate is all that? Yeah, so this unit actually is going right now through an FDA certification process. So this will be a fully uh, class two FDA product. Uh, and we've already done a number of clinical studies uh, with the sensors. And the result has been so promising that it has led to a number of not only investment, but also partnership for us uh, with uh, uh, very well respected uh, companies across the globe. And uh, we're just going to additional clinical study as well as part of our certification process. One of the comp uh, one of the hospitals that we're going to be going into pilot with is like San Mateo County Hospital in San Jose as well. I see. And so this isn't just a laboratory curiosity. You're actually going to make this available. When can people get their hands on That's it? That's right. So uh, we're very excited about now being in a position to be able to ship limited quantities to our uh, partners for uh, additional uh, uh, piloting and analysis testing. And then we'll be in position to be in full production by August of this year. Great. Oh, sounds like an interesting development. Yes, thank you. Thank you.